true. But there are so many good players here tonight. We got Orange, we got Kinky Oats, we got Argo. <laughs> I'm not up there yet. But um we've also don't forget we got FaZe. Hunger. He's still he's still really good. Even though he got upset, he's still real it was last stock, like game three last hit, so Ah, excuse me. We got MTE. We have the you, duck. We Gonard. Got hunger. We got Gonard. We got Gonard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying that. Yep, yeah, you can say it because I, I feel like I'm the only little Mac here. Uh, you are 100% the only little Mac here, my friend. <laughs> Sorry, Trombones and um, who else? That was it. Like, yeah, Trombones uh, don't come out to these thirties. He doesn't even live here. Yeah, he's, he doesn't even live in this country. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> All right. Anyway, I'm sorry. Uh, Mortem taking a, a somewhat in the lead. Good forward air to get. Uh, uh, more the more interesting thing is that he's using Mewtwo. Uh, Mewtwo's his tried and true character, man. Like he only plays Kirby to go up against Fox because he has a, like it's either I, I, even. Or I think like, it's like I think all the space animals. Oh shit! You got SMF from uh, Peach I, there. I think like Kirby win, Kirby's either even or wins against the space animals depending on space animals. Yeah. More than wasting no time and taking that first stock. Now he's got fully charged uh, psychic. He just uses it. And uh, they actually buffed the knockback on that in the most recent update for some reason because it's not like it wasn't already one of the most hard hitting projectiles in the game. Yeah, but at least they nerfed it so that at least you shield it. It's not gonna hurt as yeah. bad. True. Uh, reduce damage against shields, or reduce power against whatever that was. It actually helps in the Mac Mewtwo matchup because now uh, it forces Mewtwo to get aggressive. But the problem is Mewtwo has the unfortunate uh, tail hitbox. Yeah. Also, can I just comment on how close this game is? Yeah, Mortem's really pushing it. Like. He has all the momentum in the world after taking out. Oh, and the Shadow Ball's gonna do it. He's got a somewhat of a lead. B2 is a little heavier now, so he'll be able to survive around like 10% longer than he would otherwise. So, good wait. damage. Oh, good uh, fair there from Peach Face. Oh, is that Gimp? Oh, he saved him! Oh my god! What a save. That happened with me when I played him. He did the, uh, I, I was dead. I upbeat, but he used his hydro pump and I got back to ledge. And he just did that with our friend Morden here. The problem is, like, we, we could possibly do that, but the problem is he had no choice. Because he couldn't have done it, because if he did, he would have most likely SD'd. Yeah. Either way, Morden was just carrying all the momentum into his, uh, second stock here. Like, Still not letting it go. Oh, good air dodge, get away. This isn't Smash 4 though, so you can't just spell Mewtwo's air dodge, unfortunately. Nah, he cannot. But I realize he was spamming spot dodge. He still has some Smash 4 blood in him. Oh, well, look at his tag, man. Are you that surprised? <laughs> no, I am not yeah. surprised at all. Down tilt forward air, definitely gonna do it at that percent. But, Mewtwo has a bit of damage on him. If you take a look at the character, he is really concentrating right now. Like, he wants to make sure... He really wants to... What? Oh wow, okay, Peach Fuzz, uh... Peach Fuzz really... And he's taking the lead. He is taking the lead, but then again, with last stock at this at this percentage, it doesn't really matter. Because, like, if Mortem gets, like, one good combo or gets one good Shadow Ball, then he can easily take... Was that, that was an that SD. Was an oh, sound. no. You never want to be off stage against Greninja, because he's so good at killing off stage with Gimping, and he can scare you, too, with his much pressure like that. Yeah. You either have to... I'll intimidate him and just say, fuck it, I'm going to go in. Or, um, be what they're going to do because, wait, are they going to the Wait. Hey, that's bit. Oh, wait, they probably gentlemen did. They, I know they gentlemen battlefield. The, the thing is, I believe, um, do the frame rate issues still occur on the battlefield form? Yes, I oh, believe. Oh, God. Okay, guys, if you see any, like, uh, frame drops, just know it's not our stream, it's the stage. Uh, there are still noticeable frame drops at Fountain of Dreams. I believe actually FD and Battlefield variations of Fountain of Dreams is actually also banned. So they probably gentlemen this hard. Yeah. Or, excuse me, one or the other has no idea. I believe this was Morum's choice because he lost. Uh, but I don't know if uh, Peach was okay with it or something around those lines. 
Let's see if Morden uh, can, like, get that lead back and hold on to it this time. Because I think maybe, you know, sometimes when you get a lead, you're like, you, you, you subconsciously think, like, I don't have to try as hard now that I'm in the lead. That's probably what happened. You got cocky? No, I, 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 he's not the type of, I mean. Well, he, in this case, he got, like, really comfortable. When yeah. He when you have, when you're always against someone who can basically use a rush down, like your Ninja, Mac, or um, Roy Fox, Crom. Roy Crom, Fox, or any of the space animals, being like even if you have the lead don't get comfortable don't just, get comfy because yes. they will always consistently apply pressure you gotta really give pressure to them or unless you have a two-stop lead mm -hmm. but even still against um a player like peach fuzz with a character like greninja i don't think you ever even if he's at 130 on his last stock and you're at like five percent on your first stock don't ever let your guard down against this man. He's he, sick Heyman for a reason. That's also uh, the same thing can apply to me, because I remember the monthly where we still thought it was we still thought it was best of three. I get jab locked into nine was ready to SD my last talk. It's like he just styled on me. Ooh! Yep. Beach Buzz is getting that concentration. He is what he a, has officially you. been downloaded and is turning into sick Heyman. <laughs> Dude, that was like amazing. Besides, oh, the, the... He, he told me this. He's here to chew bubblegum and represent Kermit, and he's all out of Kermit. Wait, what? Just... Here's the deal, right? After the set, you're going to watch me get six stocked by Orange on stream. Oh, Just man. like last time I was here. Don't worry. I, I Don't worry. I have a sick plan. I'm not going Simon. No, I, <laughs> I wasn't saying going Simon. I was saying, quick, change up your tactics. Don't use any of your items. Just use your whip. <laughs> I, I mean, yes, but at the same time, oh, last time I was playing him, he practically trapped me in this minefield. Because, like, he was jumping with aerials. He had a boomerang out, and he had a bomb in front of me. I was trapped. Like, I, I've actually been fighting this really good uh, Link. He was, like, one of the best in Smash 4 in British Columbia or Quebec or whatever. I actually started learning um, a and Peach Fuzz sick came in representing Kermit just 2-0 in the morning. And I'm about to go have some fun, so...